218.8 Yeah man, so we crushing it 218.8 pounds Things are going swimmingly With the entire program um, As you can see, the weight just keeps dropping man Consistently And uh, yeah, I'm feeling good Sleeping well, recovering good Strength's going through the roof Um I'm super I'm getting super lean. I'm I'm super excited to see where I'm going to be at in a couple months, man. Both with the YouTube channel and just my physique and my training protocols. And you know we start every day the same way doing it with Jay. We getting that na 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 nice juice. Nice and hydrated, keeping me keeping me nice and hydrated all day long. And then we making some coffee. You know, I like a nice strong black coffee. Uh, we going to get it before we start our day. Um, yeah, this this kicking horse coffee, I believe it's Canadian. It's really delicious. Honestly, man, I couldn't be more happy with the way things are going. And um, I'm just going to consistently stick to it and keep driving forward. It, things are going swimmingly, as, the, as I may say. Little uh, physique update, you know, this is first thing in the morning, about to go for a walk, feeling good, man, feeling lean. Yeah, see, you can even tell in my upper pec, you know, in this kind of shoulder area, my love handles are going down, the abs are coming through a little bit more, feeling good, man. Feeling good. This is unpumped. This is first thing in the morning. Well, and this is actually with a coffee and some water and a liter of water. You know? Yo, just going for a walk outside. It snowed just a little bit. But uh, I need to be getting outside more. It's so important for your mood and just your general health. So. Even though it's slowly getting colder here, it's good to be outside. It's good to be cold too. So we're going for a little bit of a walk. And we got podcasts, podcasts to do today. Yeah, it is pretty nice out. It's snow, but it's not that it's not that cold, you know. Anyways. Yeah. Oh, so we're gonna get some stretching in today. I'm feeling pretty sore from the workout yesterday, especially in my legs and in my back. All good. You know, we really cranked everything really strong. Uh, we lifted such good weights. Uh, the weights are getting up there. They're getting pretty heavy. So the, the workouts are definitely getting more taxing. And uh, yeah, so I'm feeling good. I want to stay mobile. I just went for a little walk, got some sun, which is super important. And now uh, I'm gonna stretch it out for uh, you know 20, 30 minutes. I'm gonna hop into a cold shower and then I got some podcasting to do. I like to make sure that I'm active and that I get at least a little bit of stretching, especially in my hips. If I'm gonna be sitting and doing the podcast, I wanna be comfortable and uh, I wanna, it helps me get focused and present into the conversations. Uh, usually if I have a lot of meetings or anything like that, I'll uh, try to train first thing in the morning. It just really helps me get my mind right. Uh, even though uh, I might be able to push it a little bit harder if, I, if I'm a little bit more awake, I'll still grind pretty hard. Um, yeah, so, uh, so we'll get into some stretching. We're going to get into that stretching today. You can even tell from uh, some of these stretches that I'm getting much leaner. Uh, things are going very, very... Look at those. Look at the triceps coming through on that stretch, man. Um, so huge. Huge, huge results, uh, especially this week. And, you know, we just continue to crush it, man. Uh, putting in the time every day. I, I think people are just get too caught up in the... And I hate to say weight fluctuation because the weight isn't fluctuating. It's, yeah, if I was to eat the exact same thing every single day, which I will, I promise. And I know I said I, that I will and I will do that. Um, 
but I also like to live life too. Like you'll see tonight, we're going out for hot pot with the homies. Shout out Andrew. Shout out Brandon, my brother. So we're going out tonight. And, uh, you know, what we're going to do is this is going to be the, you know, only night probably. There's one or two nights where I'm like, bro, the calories, it doesn't matter tonight, you know. So we're going to hot pot tonight. And if y'all don't know that, you get a bowl of broth and then you basically it's all you can eat. And there's proteins, vegetables, there's some starches. I might get a little bit of carbs, but mostly it'll be just meat and vegetables. And, um, and uh, yeah, and uh, I'm going to have a beer. You'll see later tonight as well. And this is just, it's just realistic, man. Um, and, um, and it's nothing to feel guilty about. I've been eating clean. I've been crushing my goals and it's going to be realistic. And so, you know, you get two hours to eat and see, this is why that one hour, and this is why I, I say the two hours is fine because we're sitting there cooking our food continuously the whole time. So the two hour window is kind of the max that I'll, I'll ever eat at and consider it one meal, you know? But I would say 95% of my meals are consumed, even more than that, consumed within a half an hour um, to an hour at the absolute most. But I would say 95% are consumed in 30 minutes just because I'm hungry, <laughs> you know, and I want to eat that shit ASAP. Um, but it, it's really good. And you'll see, you'll see, uh, you know, I probably eat somewhere between two and 3000 calories tonight. Uh, and you'll see that in the end of the video, but, uh, the stretching was good. Got me nice and limber. I need to do another stretching tomorrow before I hit the gym in a couple days, but doing what I can with the recovery, man, I'm looking lean. Ugh. All right, man. The thing with the cold showers is it's really good for inflammation um, one of the craziest benefits of taking a cold shower is increased uh, dopamine levels. So whatever your baseline dopamine level is, you're going to get, I believe it's a, I think it's two to three percent more. Don't quote me on that number exactly. Two to three times more than you normally would. So just taking the cold shower will make you feel better after, you know, um, on top of that, inflammation is a huge one, decrease in inflammation. And um, there is a spike in metabolism. But the one thing after doing much more research into things is I don't know if it's that significant of a spike in metabolism. Um, but it, it, there still is a spike in metabolism when you're doing the, uh, the, the cold water. Um, and why did I describe why did I decide to describe the benefits of the cold water? Because I just don't want to fucking do it, man. I never want to do it. You never want to. You want to, but you don't want to, you know. Every time it sucks, it's cold. It's you know, it's pretty nice outside, but it's still cold outside. So that means that this water is gonna be fucking cold. This is an ice or this is a cold shower. Um in Edmonton. Okay, let's just do it. Even if it's a I got a podcast. See, this is why I forced myself to do it. Because I got a podcast. And doing this really gets me alert. Um, okay, fuck it. Let's go, 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 go. Yeah, she gold. I like to try. Oh, it just got cold. Oh. I try my best to relax my body as much as I can. Oh. Oh. Get my face, get my back. Oh. You want to get that entire body, man. A lot of your face, too. Your face is going to be super important. Oh yeah, okay, we're doing it. Oh. And see, and you wanna re try to relax through it, man. It's gonna actually also teach you how to manage your stress better outside as well. Woo! It's good, man. <laughs> You're instantly awake. You're instantly awake. Even if I can stay to three or four of these a week, 
because it's hard, man. It's hard when it's cold here to do them every day. But I mean, I know that's just an excuse. I am awake. <laughs> I am awake. Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy. Uh, just finishing podcasting. Just gonna hit the uh, hot bath now. Maybe hit the sauna. I don't know if I have some time. I'll have time. My homie's coming over, uh, and then he's gonna take me and my brother out for a. Uh, a uh, belated birthday dinner. We're going to get some hot pot, which is going to be sick. It might be a little high in sodium, which, which is going to be fine. Um, but you know what it's going to be? It's going to be a fuck ton of yummy, fucking delicious protein. So I'm super excited to uh, to hit the hot pot, man. I haven't been to hot pot in a minute. It'll be delicious. It'll be uh, it'll be dope for us to, yeah, just, just to chill out. Um, you've seen Andrew in these uh, videos before, and you'll see him again. Um, and I know I will be getting to the comments and stuff soon. Uh, I'm getting just busy as a motherfucker. Um, it's, it's one thing to be posting these videos every day. It's another thing to be uh, hopping in the comment section every day, too. At the beginning, I could. But now I'm hoping maybe I'll try to do it twice a week. Because uh, I like I like the questions, man. I like the comments. Some of y'all funny motherfuckers, man. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I also like hearing what's going on with your journeys and everything. So yeah, make sure you put those in the comments. I do read them. Uh, I appreciate all the love, all the support. Our channel's still growing like crazy. Uh, every like, every share really means the world. Yeah, we got lots of cool stuff uh, coming up on the on the YouTube channel. Uh, but the old man videos are, are, are doing me well. Man, I'm sore as fuck from that workout yesterday, too. My legs, whoo, boy, they are rocked, which is so solid. Um, yeah, I could feel that they were a grind when I was doing them yesterday, but I'm excited to keep pushing. Uh, we'll see how uh, how it goes. I'm excited to hit the gym on Wednesday. I really am. I'm excited just to be moving up in weights. I'm excited for a lot of things. And, uh, yeah. All right. I, uh, I got out of the bath. It wasn't too hot, so I stuck into the sauna, and I am, I'm hot. <laughs> so, uh, we'll get out of here. I think I'm going to do one more cold shower right after this because my homie should be dropping by soon. And uh, the cold shower will help me just kind of cool right off because I am roasting right now. But it's good. It's good. Man, um, good day of recovery today. We'll do uh, some more uh, mobility and stretching tomorrow. And then we'll be, you know, we'll be in it. Be all ready to go. Yeah, feeling great. Feeling great. Feeling lean. Um, yeah, hella productive this week too. It'll be good. Yeah, so here I am with the boys. You know, we uh we getting some hot pot, bruh. It's uh we got some kind of crazy broth, a bunch of sauces. There's the beer. We got a nice Chinese beer, and then we got this little robot that kept delivering us the food. It it was amazing, man. It's such a good time. Here's just a little shot of uh, of what we ate. You know, that's basically we ate all of this food. Uh, pretty crazy. It was an awesome time. Shout out to my homie. More love, more success. I'll be back tomorrow, man.